Hello, my name is Jonah Gaska, the manager of academic and multimedia services here at Los El College. Today I'm going to give you a brief overview of the brand new Land School Teacher Console, which enables the professor in the Duran Mac Lab to leverage sharing the instructor station or the student stations via the projector in the room. So the first thing you'll see when you um, log into the computer is the projector control, control page will load, which is this guy right here, which I'll minimize, and then also the land school teacher console will load. Uh, right now, the way it's set up, it actually brings up and shows all of the student stations um, right off the bat when you log in. So uh, I'm recording this from my classroom. I can remotely uh, connect to the instructor station. So in the lab right now, there's a couple of students that are logged into uh, various stations. Uh, so if we wanted to show a student station via the, the console to the projector, we would just select a student and then click on show student. And it's going to say, you're about to show the student screen to 17 computers. Do you want to continue? So what that'll do is it'll show the student stations on all of the other screens that are in the lab. Um, I'm not going to do that right now because I don't want to interrupt other students that are um, doing things right now. Um, another thing that we could do is we could select all the stations in the lab by pressing Command A and then if we click the show. This will actually show the instructor station on all of the monitors uh, that are in the lab. I'll go ahead and do that. <clears throat> when it does that, it, it goes into this full screen mode and in order to exit you have to just launch the te teacher application from the dock again. So I'm just going to click that and what that'll do is that'll exit the mode. Uh, there's two different ways that a professor can show the screen. There's full screen, which doesn't give the student the option to move or rearrange the window at all. And then there's windowed, which allows the student to move the window around and so that they can continue to use the computer. So depending on what type of demo you're doing, if you want them to just watch, you probably want to use the full screen option or if you want them to follow along, you're going to want to use the windowed option. Again, how to access that, you click the little arrow that's to the right here. There are a bunch of other functions that are built into this application. Um, <clears throat> we could select a couple computers and then we could restart them. We could um, you know, blink the screens out. We could sneak, uh, take a picture snapshot of something. Um, if we wanted to save it for later. Uh, one setting that I've seen that um, has gotten the way of the production, like the, the video quality, is this uh, color reduction setting. So how we can access that is go to Teacher, Preferences. If you notice that when you're sharing a student's uh, computer and it, it really isn't looking very good, we want to disable this color reduction option just hit apply and what that'll do is that'll broadcast a higher quality video um, output to all the stations. The Land School application automatically launches when you log into the computer but if for whatever reason if you close the application which I'll um, just quit the application manually right now uh, how we could relaunch it is we just go under the finder under applications and then just search for land school uh, and then we just relaunch that and it'll bring the application right back up well that's that's basically it if you have any questions or um, would like to schedule a time to look at this more in depth just send an email to helpdesk at lasalle.edu or give us a call at 617 243-2200. All right, that's it. I'm signing off. Have a good one.